What's up, people? Welcome back to my channel. Alright y'all, so in today's video, I am going to be going to Best Buy. <laughs> so, I don't know if you guys know, but my mom has started her own YouTube channel. And we're going to get her a camera today. <laughs> so, I'm just going to take you guys along with me, or with us, of getting the camera and all of that good stuff. Um, I don't think she has a specific camera that she's looking for. Um, I don't think she really looked at specific cameras. She just wants a camera. So um, I have been looking at them for her. Um, I, she already knows about this one because you know we currently have this one. Um, but I've been looking at the Canon G7X. I was gonna get that camera, but then like the Sony ZV-1 camera was like being hyped up and saying like that's the best vlogging camera this that and the third and I was like okay let's just get it you know and we got it so now it's time to get my mama camera I'm still interested in the Canon G7X camera I don't know it's just been yeah so we're gonna look at the Canon G7X for my mom and I don't I don't know if y'all know but I'm the one who's editing filming and doing all the lighting things for her videos. So this is kind of exciting for me. It feels like I'm getting a second camera, but it's still her camera, but like I'm using it to help her with her channel, if that makes sense. I'm just gonna take you guys along with me. If we get the camera, I'm gonna do a little unboxing for you guys. And we're gonna compare the Sony ZV-1 to the camera that we get. Hopefully it's the Canon G7X. So I can tell y'all which is really the best camera because I've been using this camera for a couple months now and I like it it's a pretty good camera so and I'm also try vlogging off the new camera and compare it to see if there's like really a big difference in quality between the G7X or whatever camera that I get um, in this camera so yeah so I'm gonna take you guys along with me I'm so excited this is the fit for today I want to be comfortable so I just do on what is this Y'all see this, y'all see this, I can't think of the name right now. I have a shirt on and I have some black sweats and I have my Uggs. You know, chill fit, but still look cute. My hair is still in this straight hairstyle, but I put flexorize in my hair to make it last longer. It's been like a couple weeks since I straightened my hair and it's starting to frizz up a little bit, but it's still holding up, so. Hopefully I can make this stretch for like another week and then I'll probably be washing my hair soon. But that's kind of off topic, so. Yeah, so right now I'm about to go get me some food. I can't really get food food because I don't know if y'all watched my last video, but me and my, I don't even know what my mom's doing anymore, but I'm participating in the Daniel Fast, so I can't be eating like regular food. Like I just have, like I have to eat like plant-based foods, you know, make sure it's not like, white rice you know white bread and stuff like that i can't eat bread that has yeast and gluten and all that stuff in it so i don't know like it's only been one day and i'm already struggling so if y'all got any advice <laughs> in regards to like what foods like or what meals i should eat help assist out because she's struggling over here okay mm -hmm. so yeah so i'm about to go find me some food and then i'll see you guys when we're on our way to best buy people's I am back it is like 
dang on near a week later. <laughs> it's been like four days since I showed you guys of me and my mom going to Best Buy to look for a camera to purchase a new camera. Um, I'm gonna just give y'all like a little rundown on like the whole camera situation. So like I said in the previous clips before, um, me and my mom are getting her a camera because I don't know if y'all know, but my mom has started a YouTube channel. So, um, she wants a camera for her channel. Um, so right now we have this one camera. We, me and my mom are just taking turns, like taking turns sharing this camera. Um, but like it's starting to clash like because you know with me I like almost film like every day so when I'm trying to film there's times that she wants to film so it's starting to get a little bit like difficult on like you know in, in regards to like filming and stuff so my mom was like we should just go get a camera um so yeah um and we got a new camera <laughs> Yeah, so that's what I said in that last vlog. So me and my mom, we went to Best Buy. We originally got a camera, um, and we returned it. I don't, I don't think my mom liked it, so we returned it, and we went back to Best Buy to see if they had the Canon G7X in stock, and they didn't. It was out of stock. Um, the dude was like, "What did he say? <laughs> he said you can order it offline." And it, will, it could be either delivered to the store or we could deliver it to your house. And it'll take about, like, I don't know, maybe like a couple weeks or so. Like, he said it would be, like, delivered on the 20th. And I believe, I don't remember what today's date, but I remember. Let me go back so, like, I can find it. So, yeah, hold on. Give me, like, one second. So, Tuesday was the 10th. He was saying that um, it will be delivered on the 20th, and my mom was like, no, I don't want to wait that long. <laughs> she was a little impatient. So um, we came home, and before we decided to buy any of the camera, um, we did our research on different types of cameras. And I know from, like, you know, from like YouTube and like TikTok and all that stuff. I know the camera that I'm on right now is a good camera, a vlog, good vlogging camera, and uh, the Canon G7X is a good vlogging camera. So that's why I told you in the previous clip that we might be looking uh, or buying a Canon G7X, but my mom, she wanted to get a different camera, um, but she didn't like it, so she returned it. Yeah, so we did our research on the camera. We were debating whether to get the Canon G7X Mark II or the Canon G7X Mark III. So at first, um, I was all for the Canon G7X Mark III, but like I was doing my research and they were basically saying like, um, there's like issues with autofocus and all that stuff and I was like I like I was like ain't this supposed to be like a newer camera or whatever the case may be but um, and they were saying like the mark II is like way better supposedly um so not knowing that my mom had already decided to get the mark three I was like hey ma like <laughs> I was like I was doing my research and I don't know like if the mark three is like the best camera or whatever like we might should go for the mark two because we were saying that there's issues with like the autofocus and this that and the third but uh so she canceled it <laughs> she canceled the order and i was like why'd you cancel it because i didn't know that she had placed the order like if she placed the order i'd be like oh well okay just whatever um but she canceled the order and we started doing more research it was on youtube it was on google and stuff trying to figure out like which one is the better mark th uh, the mark three or mark two we came to the conclusion that we're just gonna get the Mark III because it what it films in 4K, I believe, and it's just like it's an upgraded one of the Mark II. And plus, um, all these you know reviews in regards to like the autofocus was like three years ago. We're in 2023 now. Like we're like I'm assuming that such that issue should have got solved. So she placed the order and we. Well, she actually, we actually purchased it off Amazon because, like I said, Best Buy was out of stock. And my mom did not want to wait that long to get the camera. So, we placed the order on Amazon. And two days later, it arrived. So, it actually arrived yesterday and now I'm, like, unboxing it today. 
so I feel like I was just all over the place but yes I am going to be unboxing the Canon G7X Mark III for you guys um and to kind of give y'all a little comparison on like the quality and to see like if it is a really a uh, good camera like which one's better the Sony's if you want or like the Canon G7X but um yeah so one of these cameras either this Sony camera or the Canon camera my mom was, will be using and then I'll be using the other camera and you know yeah so I'm about to go ahead and unbox this for you guys I'm gonna stop talking I feel like I was talking too much it's like every time I have an unboxing I have a little story time for you guys on like the process of it like do y'all even care Alright y'all, so I'm about to turn this on and I'm going to compare it to see which quality is better. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. It's recording, okay. <laughs> Alright y'all, so I am on both cameras right now. So there's going to be like the Sony ZV-1 on this side and the Canon on this side. So far, looking at the viewfinders. I'm kind of liking the Canon. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I feel like the Canon makes me look more like myself compared to like the Sony. Um, but hold on. All right. So in regards to the Canon, it's like ignore me on the Sony. The so I keep saying Sony. It's Sony. Um, it focuses really well like that's crazy because when i was watching okay so when i was watching the um the reviews it was saying that the uh, canon g7x mark three did not focus and it, i guess it all depends because sometimes when i do it on the sony it doesn't focus 
Like, hold on, let me do it. We're gonna see, and the camera's about to die on the cannon, but let's see if it'll focus. Oh, I wasn't in frame. Hold on, let's do that again. <laughs> okay. All right, the Sony wins with like focusing, but like it's not as bad as they were making it out to be. It all depends, I guess. I don't know, like, but I don't, it's not too bad, like. Hmm. It's not too bad. And it's slowly, on the cannon, it slowly comes back. With the Sony, it automatically comes back, so. In regards to like, it focusing, yes, the Sony definitely wins with that. But as in the quality, like I'm really just here for the quality. I really want to see if there's like a real big quality difference. Um, because the Canon G7X does shoot in 4K and supposedly. <laughs> um, the Canon G7X does uh, film in 4K and the Sony does too. So I want to see like, if, is there a real quality difference? Oh, this was zipped up. But yeah, I really wanted to see if there's like a major quality difference. Um, so from me just filming, I feel like the Canon looks more natural. Like with the Sony, it looks more orangey. Like, I don't know if that makes sense. I don't know if I'm making makes sense, but the Sony looks more orange. Like my skin looks more red. Um, on the Canon, it looks natural. It looks like how it looks like in person, I guess. So I'm kind of here for the canon on that one because I kind of like that natural look. Um, so audio, I won't be able to tell what the audio sound like until I edit this video. So as y'all watching this, y'all can tell um, the difference in audio. So I'll let you know. I'll put a pop up on the screen, let you know what audio that I'm using to see if there's like a major difference in audio. Um, what else? What else did he test on YouTube? It was mainly like the uh, focus, the focus, like thing. Like it was saying that it wasn't focusing on people's faces and stuff. And like I'm moving around and it is very much so focusing. Like it is tracking my face everywhere I go. So. I'm kind of starting to like the cannon, I ain't gonna lie. So, so yeah, it doesn't really want to focus on that. Yeah, the Sony definitely wins in regards to like focusing. I guess you have to like tap on it. So it focus on like what you want it to be on. Uh, yeah, so there's like, it's a little issue in regards to like the focus part, but I mean, I feel like that's not really, a, a major issue when you're vlogging I guess because if it's like focus on your face it's focus on your face like if you're trying to show a product or something you may have to tap on the screen so it'll focus like in this situation it's not focusing but if I tap on the screen oops but if I tap on the screen it will focus you see that now in regards to the Sony it automatically focus so Sony definitely went with that but Overall, I didn't really do like a much in-depth comparison. If y'all really want me to film an in-depth comparison, <laughs> why I say it like that? If you guys want me to film a real in-depth comparison, please let me know in the comments. Um, cause I can do that. But like from me just you know looking at the viewfinder on both cameras, I'm liking the Canon. Like I really like. I really like it like it just I don't know like it looks natural it looks more natural um, on the Sony it's very much red <laughs> it's more orangey like y'all can probably see like it looks more natural and this looks more like orange so in the quality they both look the same like I said I still have to you know I won't be able to see fully until I edit the video but yeah so yeah this is the little unboxing slash mini review all right so i am back on the sony right now and i'm going to close out the video using the sony um the battery 
has to be fully charged. Um, the battery didn't come charged, so I charged it halfway so I can get this video out, but I'm gonna have to go finish that. But, um, yeah, like I said, I really have to just continue playing with it to really see, like, if there's, like, a major difference. Um, I didn't play with the settings much at all, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that for a couple of days, and, you know, I might just, I'm gonna vlog with this camera for a few days to see if I like it, and, um, eventually I'll give, like, a full, uh, I, I don't know. Maybe I can give like a full review in regards to it, but yeah, so far both cameras are pretty good. It just all depends. <laughs> um, I just, I don't know. I have to do, like I said, I need to play with it a little bit more to see if I really, if I really, really like one over the other. But yeah, y'all, so this is going to conclude the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed um so yeah if you like this video please make sure that you like comment and subscribe and also hit that bell notification so you'll be notified for each time that i post a new video and i'll see you guys in my next one bye